So now we are going to answer some fan questions. Yes. Is that okay? You ready? Yes, it is. All right, great. So um, first fan question from at Benny Factor on Twitter asks, do you prefer uh, San Pellegrino or Perrier or some other sparkling mineral water that we've never heard of? At Benny Factor on Twitter asks, what kind of sparkling water do I prefer? Well, in fact, Benny, the answer is quite complex. It differs according to my mood. I can tell you this. If I am drinking sparkling water on its own, I might prefer San Pellegrino, uh, which is an Italian sparkling water. Um, I uh, like San Pellegrino under that circumstance. I could tell you that my favorite sparkling water to drink after espresso is the German Gerolsteiner water, which is quite a freak of nature. The mineral content is so incredibly high. Over 2,000 parts per million total dissolved solids, also known as TDS. And um, the mineral content is so high, in fact, that if you were to drink a liter of it a day, you would have a quarter of your daily requirement of magnesium. And magnesium is a very difficult mineral to obtain. Uh, supplementing uh, orally is inefficient. I rub magnesium lotion all over my body to make use of transdermal absorption. See, people don't understand. Sometimes they use artificial products that they rub on their skin, like uh, certain sunscreens and lotions, and they say, it's okay, I'm not eating it, it's just on my skin. But whatever you put on your skin goes into your bloodstreams. For example, people wear a nicotine patch um, and other medication patches um, for a very direct absorption into the bloodstream. So, uh, for example, cavemen used to swim in the ocean all the time, and the ocean is a rich source of magnesium. That transdermal exposure gave the cavemen the magnesium they needed. Now, swimming in the ocean has fallen out of favor for most of us, uh, and therefore other methods are necessary. Organ meats have also fallen out of favor, another rich dietary source of magnesium. Um, nevertheless, Gerolsteiner, to me, has such a dense minerality um, that perfectly suits the bitter complexity that you get from drinking an espresso. Wow, okay. And where do you get, is that, do you just get it from the internet? The great thing about Gerolsteiner is it's Gerolsteiner. so readily available. It can be found at every Trader Joe's store that I've been to. It could be found at Whole Foods. I think it costs a dollar forty-nine at Trader Joe, a dollar sixty-nine at Whole Foods. Oh my God! However, if you buy a case uh -huh. of Gerolsteiner water at Whole Foods, they give you a unadvertised ten percent case discount, bringing the price down seventeen cents per liter. 